Okay, so now we're going to, after our three hour timer went off, we're going to take the dough out and then we are going to shape it. This takes time and practice. It's not gonna be as easy. When you do it the first few times, you're going to absolutely think it's a disaster. Don't worry, take your little trusty rubber and it will pretty much just spill out. Ta ta ta, see? I'm gonna wet one hand and we're just going to turn it under at a 45, bring it closer, bring it under and bring it closer. And you're gonna keep doing that until it makes a pretty shape. Now you're gonna to want to sprinkle with the white rice flour till you get to where you're used to this because it'll stick and gum and you'll wanna cry. It takes practice to get to where you can do this, but once you get it, you'll be like, oh, I got it. So you're gonna turn it at a 45 in a circle with this hand as your support pulling it in. 45 degree circle with this hand is supporting it. The tighter you make this ball to where it's really nice and shiny, see that, how shiny? It will be a better bread. Like, see that? That is beautiful. Then I always put lots of white rice flour on it Add to that, no matter what. This is hard, you'll get to the, used to this too. We'll move that. And you're gonna take it, pick it up, flip it, and dump it in. And as you can see, there's really not much there. Then you're gonna pinch, and lighting sucks. You're gonna pinch, pinch, pinch. And it'll stick because you don't have no white rice flour on that part yet. And you're just gonna pinch it and it'll hold and it'll come undone a little bit, but it's still gonna make it tight. Then you're gonna take your white rice, sprinkle it all on the edges, moving it around so that it doesn't stick. A little on the top so it don't stick to your plastic. Put this over it, and you're gonna put it in the refrigerator. And I'll see you in the morning.